In this video, we are going to look at a solid block toppling down like Humpty Dumpty. So we have this uh, uniform solid block. You are given the weight of the block. Let me highlight this. And the width of 0.4 meter, height 0.6 meter, and the block rests on the edge of a step like this. All right. The block is knocked over the edge and rotates 90 degrees before coming to rest. Uh, with the 0 0.6 meter edge horizontal. And thankfully, they draw it for you. Lah, okay, so this is the 0 0.6 meter edge that was vertical. And after it topples down, bloop, maybe someone kicked it. Okay, uh, the 0 0.6 meter is horizontal. What is the change in GPE of the block? Okay, now you may be tempted to say, well, teacher, you know, See, uh, the initial position is here. Final position is here. I know change in GPE will be mg change in height. Ah, teacher. And then they tell me oh, the weight of the block, mg, the weight of the block is 500 Newton. So can I just substitute this one as 500 and the change in height is this one? If this is what you are thinking, Think again. Is this the real change in height? Really? Remember in the beginning of this chapter, we understand the idea of center of mass? So actually, the center of mass of my block is here. This is my initial, this is my initial position. And the final position is here. Ding, 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 ding. So actually, this is my change in height. Okay, this entire height. Oh... This is your delta H. So this is wrong. Okay, not 0 0.8. Ah. Okay, let's try to find delta H. Okay, so we know that uh, the height from here to here is 0 0.3. Okay, half of the 0 0.6 H. And we know the height from here to here is half of 0 0.4. Okay, half of this 0 0.4. So here to here would be... 0 0.2 meter and you may be thinking teacher what about the intermediate one between here and here I, uh, here to here this height this green color height is actually 0 0.4 minus 8 point i'm uh, sorry 0 0.4 minus 0 0.8 the difference between 0 0.8 and 0 0.4 this will be 0 0.4 meter okay so i will take the this the total change in height will be this plus this zero point four plus this zero point two. Okay, so I'm gonna put that in. The change in GPE will be five hundred times zero point three plus zero point four plus zero point two. This will be five hundred times uh zero point nine. Okay, 0 0.3, 0 0.2, 0 0.9. And finally, this will allow you to come up with the answer of 450 joules. Yeah, that's it. So please, whenever there is a solid object, not a point mass, and you want to consider the change uh, in GPE, take the center of mass. That's why, uh, because this is uniform solid block, the center of mass or the center of gravity is at the midpoint. So here is a COG, and here is a COG. So we have to take from center of gravity to the next center of gravity, here to here. It's not 0 0.8, it's actually 0 0.9. Okay, that's it for this example. Go try some questions. There's another strange toppling block question somewhere in your past years. Go do that. I'll see you in the next example video. Stay curious. Bye-bye.